Good evening, I'm Mark Kiesling. And I'm Julie Williams. Right now, there are projects underway to rebuild some southern Illinois ports. Those ports will help streamline the process of bringing consumer goods to our area. Right now, most of those goods arrive by truck or train. But river ports will help provide a direct link for products to be brought in on the Mississippi and Ohio rivers. Project leaders say it's critical for farmers who depend on fertilizer and other essential supplies. Officials also say the ports will create jobs and expand surrounding economies. And one of those projects is in Shawneetown. News 3's Madeline Parker spoke with lawmakers about how the project will benefit an area left behind. If you look at infrastructure and when you look at Rebuilt Illinois, this is exactly what Rebuilt Illinois was meant for. Inside the Shawneetown Regional Port District, Senator Dale Fowler, Illinois Secretary of Transportation Omer Osman, and other community members came together to solidify plans for the revitalization of the Shawnee Town Port. It's a major project for Southern Illinois, especially here in Gallatin County. And the, the, you know, the opportunities, this is going to be approximately 240, 250 construction jobs, full-time jobs, and this project's going to be kicking off here real soon. With $11.2 million in funding coming from the state, project leaders say the port will help revitalize the surrounding agricultural area. Uh, there's a uh, have been a decline uh, in uh, in the economy of this area, and this is a perfect, perfect way of uplifting the entire area. This Unemployment, it's not bad here, but jobs are good. Jobs are hard to come by. Yeah, so this will hire people, truck drivers, fertilize people. Just, just a. A whole cross section. Senator Dale Fowler says the old coal loading dock that is already in place will help speed the process along. This coal loading dock already here, so the conversion is going to be fairly simple because the permitting is completed and such, such as that. Construction is expected to be completed by late December and January 2023 will see the port up and running. And to be able to take uh, again uh, an old coal loading facility that's been out of commission for many years to revitalize that, put people to work and create hope, more hope here in Southern Illinois is exciting. I'm just honored to be a part of it. In Shawneetown, Madeline Parker, News 3. Another Southern Illinois port project continues moving forward. The Carroll Port Project is now working with the Army Corps of Engineers on getting permits for development. Project leaders have presented plans to the governor's office and are waiting for the next round of funding. 